You and I both know Bill Clinton gave Arafat and the Palestinians everything you know, you they have could have wanted. You such a stunningly superficial knowledge of what went on that it's almost embarrassing to listen to you. Oh, is it? If you were to look more closely at what happened in the Clinton-Camp uh, David discussions, you would know that what we have just said is absolutely wrong. There were all sorts of provisions and catches to the so-called proposal, and it wasn't rejected. The negotiations went on in Taba, and then there were elections in Israel. And Sharon came in, and everything got aborted. We have another block, and I'm very excited about that because I'm stunningly superficial. <laughs> Chief, I look forward to you educating me and the rest of America. Hold on, the rest of America and the rest of the foreign policy community who have said time and again, Arafat walked away from the best deal he could have got, and that the Palestinians well, never miss an opportunity to miss slogans. an opportunity. You're What's repeating it? slogans. You're repeating slogans. He did not right, walk we'll away. What he said break. was, I'm going to take the proposal to all of the Arab capitals and see how they react, because the proposals were controversial. And then negotiations went on, even after Christmas, where Clinton and Arafat met, and they were going on in Taba in January, after Clinton was already leaving office, and then the process got aborted.